Brittany's a Christian producer. She's had a savant calling her whole life going to the best heaven. And she will never work minimum wage. Ever again. And she will never work for over an hour for the rest of her life. Brittany has thalassemia and she has a restraining order from every employee at every brothel business because it's ancient. And Brittany is going to reveal slave trade with all the Christian infinity artists who've been anti-slave trade for 20 years with a savant calling to save their employee network's lives when they have been kicked out and cut off and have been sex trafficked because it's human trafficking. And since the beginning of time, there have been exploitive kings and queens who invaded a boundary, who threatened to recruit employees for human trafficking because it would run the economy. And they ran the economy by extortion. It's ancient, where they worshiped a stay-at-home mom or dad. And they exploited the artists because they were jealous. And the artists would be starving on the street, cut off from their society. And they would control them and threaten them with anyone with a stable job, worshiping, healing, worshiping a stable job, worshiping an education. And they would have their professors and their influencers with every major business recruit human trafficking for every major business. But worshiping those idols leads to a fundamentalist horror film with Satanist doctors for their slave trade for stem cell. And it was always like that. But the world is more evil than ever before. And it's every major business where they have their influencers working for them. Except God controls the United States of America and Israel with a democracy. And God takes the side of the Jewish Christians who've been exploited. And after 20 years of a calling to work all day in 11 hours of traffic out of every major city, they get a break. And their calling is to pay and rescue the lives of all the exploited employees because they were skipped and they weren't paid with celebrity sales as a referral for their retail sales network and their sales network out of the city, out of every major city outside of human trafficking for the celebrities who passed laws to steal their oil and steal their money when they earned 80000 a day required by law for every $1,200 job that would have paid eighty every day when they were exploited by billionaires at the club. And we are doing our best with the United States of America, military, FBI, doctors and lawyers outside of a brothel to get them paid to save their lives. Say no to a career for God. Never invade a boundary and stand up for them, having passive income for life. Our American government bows down to God. This is a politician, and they are sued when they are slave trade, and we are protecting them with our lives when they're exploited by slave trade and they're innocent. Christian godly influencers, writers, producers who are freelancing and who need a break with passive income and healing, celebrity sales. Because even if you're the rare top percentage who made 250 for the past 20 years, you still require a top percentage through celebrity sales to pay for your assistants, nannies, cleaning ladies to have a break after 20 years with a property and money for life. A moment of silence. Their bank account their children were rescuing their lives. It's financial.